Greetings my healers, this is Nick Entel, and welcome back to Pokemon Blue. Now you see, I trained my Pokemon off screen, up to level 55, and look at Hurricane. He learned... Hold on, he learned... Mirror move, there we go. Now all of my Pokemon are all set with their move sets. So yeah, all I did was train my Pokemon at the Pokemon Mansion, no nothing else. I swear. So let's see, we're going to read this sign. Cinnabar, I ah, we already read the sign, that's the town sign. And this is where we're going to next, the Pokemon Mansion. I have my map right here. I took some screenshots from strategywiki.org on the, you know, the Pokemon Mansion, so now I can see where I'm going. So there's an item, item all the way up to, at the north. And there's a bed over there. Oh, let's get this item first. Oops. So, as I was saying, there's an item over here. What is it? Escape rope, thanks. But I don't really need escape ropes, Dragon Nose Dig. So to the west there's a bed. Oh god damn it. So over here to the west there's a bed and a statue. Okay, there's a statue over here, so let's see what it does. A secret switch. Press it, yes. Who wouldn't? Oh yeah, so that's where the press it who wouldn't go came from. That that this one came from Gen 1. So that switch was supposed to open gates. Let's see, there are two beds down here south. Okay, I said there was a, there were two beds. There's nothing over here. Is there a hidden item over here? No, there isn't. So let's go up and then to the east. Maybe there's a hidden item over here. I'm clicking, but there's nothing here. Except a wild Pokemon. Okay, there are no hidden items over here. Except a hidden po- I'm, I mean a wild Pokemon again. Alright, let's continue east. Hopefully I don't get interrupted again, but I can get in If I get interrupted, then I'll just gain experience points. Okay, there's a gate over here, so if I maybe if I press that switch again, maybe that'll, that'll un unlock it. I'll be right back. Yo, I was right, the switch did unlock the gate, so if I go- But there's a gate blocking that, that path. Oh, that sucks. Now if I go down here, there's another gate. Oh, that sucks. So, I gotta go back to the beginning. There are stairs over there. Yo, I'm back over here at the stairs, so there's nothing over here, and now let's go up. Okay, I'm gonna swipe on my iPad, and it looks like I'm on the second floor. And there's another switch over here. A secret switch. Press it, yes. Who wouldn't? And I see there's a train over there. He's part of the, C the Cinnabar Mansion. Hey, hey, you- no battle? Huh, that's weird. I can't get out! This old place is one big puzzle! Oh, you sneaky bastard, you do want a battle. You just didn't have the exclamation point above your head. Ah, you're a burglar. Well, I'm gonna stop you from stealing stuff. Ah, Charmander, Dragon's first form. Now let's show off your new move, Swords Dance. Ah, very nice. Get a taste of that sword. Oh, Charmander, no slash, ouch. Now use Dig. Ground type moves beat fire types. Peekaboo, bye bye, Charmander. <laughs> What's next, Charmeleon? I thought so, yes! Dragon second form. Now you dig again. Now you see me, now you don't. Uh, now you see me, he popped up! Good job, Dragon. Well done, you defeated your original forms. Oh no, my bag of loot! Can I have it, please? Red is poor. Well, actually, he's not poor, he's in the, he's in the triple digits, look. See, look at all that money, almost at 200,000 Poké Dollars. Switches open and close alternating sets of doors. Yeah, that's what I figured out. I'm looking at the map, and there, are, there's another set of stairs over here. Oh, there's an item and a book. Look at that, Dragon grew to level 56 after fighting a wild Ponyta. So, I'm gonna give another Pokémon a chance to level up. Um, Lucky, how about you? Go up, girl. Let's see, there's a book over here. Okay, as I was saying- Oh, th th that unlocked the gates over here. Let's see, there's nothing over here. Nope. So that's pointless. Oh my god, I accidentally pressed Skull Bash on a wild coughing, but luckily she didn't get poisoned from smug. Lucky, I mean. So there's a book over here. Let's see what it says. Oh, a diary. Gi diary, July 5th, Guyana, South America. A new Pokemon was discovered deep in the jungle. Real countries exist in the Pokemon world? Huh. 
I haven't played Gen 1 for so long that I, I, I'm I surprised that real countries and continents exist in the, in the Pokemon world. Ooh, now let me see. What's this? Calcium, ah. Does that, um, raise speed? I think it does. I'm gonna see who has the lowest speed. Crystal is the slowest, so he gets the calcium. Here you go. Cri oh, special, my bad. Damn it, I should have looked up on the iPad. I should have looked up on Strategy Wiki. Oh, actually, Bulbapedia. Never mind. But his special went up, whatever. So, I'm looking down at the map, and there's another entry down there. Let's see if the gate is closed or open. It's open! Yes, I can read the entry! Okay, let's see what it says. Diary, July 10th. We christened the newly discovered Pokémon, Mew. That's interesting. So, christening does exist in the Pokémon world. So, I'm gonna go up here to see if there are any hidden items. No, nothing. So, I have to go back and press that switch. So, as I was saying, I have to go back up here to press that switch, so that opens the gate up there. Or do I want to go up those stairs first? I don't know, um... I think I'll go up these stairs first, yeah. Oh, there's another burglar over here, and another entry. Diary entry. Let's see, where am I? Um, I have no idea. Excuse me, let me talk to you. This place is like huge, damn right it is. Just like your sunglasses and your bag of loot, give, give it to me, please. Though of course burglars aren't generous, he has only one Pokemon. Nine tails. Interesting. Okay, Lucky, use Skullbash. Show that nine tails what you have. Lucky lowered her head. Ha! <laughs> Ember missed. Yes! Punch him right in the- bash him right in the gut, or the shoulder, wherever you hit him. Ha! <laughs> burglar, your fox is no match for me. Ah, yeah! Or Lucky, my Persian. Oh, thank you for that loot, that's a lot. I wonder where my partner went. Your business partner, I know. Diary, February 6th, Mew gave birth. We named the newborn Mewtwo. Wasn't... Wasn't Mewtwo genetically- wasn't Mewtwo created by using the gen genetics of, of Mew from the scientists? Mew has genitals? Okay. Oh, Max Revive, thank you. I thought there was a hidden item up here, and there was. Good thing I went up here. And there's an item down here. Max Potion, thank you. Some more medicine. So, you know how how most legendary Pokémon are sexless and it has no gender confirmed at, according to Bulbapedia? Yeah, they, they're pretty much sexless, so they pretty much have no genitals. Most legendary Pokemon, I mean. So I'm going to press this switch next. A secret switch. Press it? Yes. Who wouldn't? Now I'm going back up here. See? The gate is- the door is unlocked. And we're going up these stairs. Let's see where I am next. Oh. Wait. Am I supposed I'm confused. I don't think I have a map of this. Okay, I see what I did wrong. I forgot to take a screenshot of floor 3. Let's see. Got my iPad. Let's go back. Let's see. Where am I? Oh yeah, I'm on floor 3. So, I'm, I'm good. I pressed the switch, I believe. Did I? Yeah, I don't remember. And there's an item over there to the east. So that burglar with the nine tails was on the other- was on the bottom of floor 3, which I'm on right now. So, I'm all set. That's this item. Iron. That raises defense. I'm gonna give... Oh, I know who to give the iron to. Wait! Uh, I mean, Lightning can't take any more d irons, can he? No, no effect. So, maybe Lucky can have it? Lucky's defense rose. Good girl. Fuck, why can't Lucky have it? Uh, why can't Lightning have any more irons? 220 Poké Dollars obtained from a wild magmar. So, the, the, the door is locked over here, so I need to open it. Oh, god damn it! A secret switch. Press it? Yes, of course. Who wouldn't? Aha, so that locked that door and opened this one. Hey, scientist, over here! And there are two exits down here. My mentor once lived here. Who's your mentor, Mr. Fuji? I mean, Dr. Fuji? Yeah, I guess so. So you have three Pokemon. Magnemite. So, Lucky? I'm thinking you should use Payday first. Start with Payday on that Magnemite. Okay. 
Oh, supersonic, that sucks. Lucky became confused. Come on, Lucky, don't hurt yourself, please. Damn it, Lucky, come on. Come on. Paid it? Good job. Yes. All right. Well done, Lucky. Oh, and you leveled up. I thought you would do that. Defense is at 95. Magneton. Okay, um, yeah. So, Venus, you're up. Because she knows a ground-type move. So, Venus, use Earthquake. Rock the Pokemon Mansion, why don't ya? Magneton is down, now what's next? Another Magneton? No, Voltorb, huh. Now use Earthquake again, Venus. Let's see, yes, that's a one-hit KO. Earthquake is probably the best ground-type move. Phew, overwhelming. Yeah, your glasses are overwhelming. Look how big they are. And you have they're so overwhelming that you have no pupils or irises. So, you're stuck? Try jumping off over there. Yeah, that's great advice to give a kid, scientist. Try to encourage him to kill himself. Uh, that's not where I'm going next. I'm going down those stairs over there. So, as I said, there are stairs over there. Over here, I mean. Let's see where that leads. Swipe. And, let's see. Um... Stairs down here. Oh, I'm on the second floor. Yep, there's nothing over here, so that was useless. I need to go back up these stairs and jump off one of these ledges, as the scientist suggested. Okay, let's see. Where do I I'm going go to go here since on the map it's labeled D. Now, where am I? Oh, there's a scientist. Um, let's see. I'm on. Yeah, I'm on. I'm on floor one. That's where I left off. And there's an item down there. Who are you? There shouldn't be anyone here. Yes, there are. Th there are burglars in here. You should go after them, not me. So you're another scientist with two Pokemon. Electrode! Ooh, that's great. Level 29, are you serious? Man, you need to keep up. Use Earthquake, Venus. That's easy. Too easy. Come on. Send out, a, send out a stronger Pokemon, please. Weezing. Okay. Well, at least Venus is also a poison type, so... Level 29, seriously. Ugh. But at least she'll gain some experience points. Over 900 experience points from this. Let's see how many she'll get. Okay. Now finish off with Submission. Even though fighting type moves aren't very effective against poison types. Not much damage from Recoil, but that's okay. Oh, over 1,000 experience points. That's that's even better. Ouch! Damn right, ouch. Look at your foot. It's bent. It, your leg is bent all the way over there. A key? I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, I think... Is, is this the key? I figured you needed a key. Is this it? Carbos. Uh, that raises speed, doesn't it? So, I said that, um, Crystal was the slowest, so he gets the Carbos. Ugh! Okay, so Venus, you get it, since you're the second slowest. No effect, seriously! Alright, um... Hurricane, this one's yours. No effect, damn it. How about you, Dragon? Thank you, finally! Someone took the medicine. I mean, the vitamins. The vitamin. So, where do these stairs go? Huh. These go up in the basement, don't they? Yeah, they do. So, the, the gate is locked over there. And there's another switch down here. But first, I want to read this entry and then fight that guy. Diary, September 1st. Mewtwo is far too powerful. We have failed to curb its vicious tendencies. By the way, Mewtwo is my favorite legendary Pokemon. Okay, so there's a guy over here, a burglar. Uh-oh, where am I now? You're in the basement, dude. I bet burglars like basements. There are lots of stuff to steal down here. So you have a Growlithe. Nice. 
Use Earthquake. Bring that puppy Pokemon down. And let me guess, you have an Arcanine or just another Growlithe? Yeah, you most likely don't have an Arcanine. Ponyta, huh. Alright. Just use Rock Slide on that Ponyta. Alright, Rocks Crush Fire types. Well done, Venus, well done. Now give me your loot burglar and your sunglasses and your cap. Ow! What are you, a Growlithe? Get bent. You can find stuff lying around. Yeah, and you're stupid enough to not notice this item. As I said, you are stupid enough to not notice this item down here. TM14, what's that? I gotta find out. All the way down here. Blizzard, no thanks. Ice Beam is good enough for Crystal. Okay, press it. A secret switch. Press it, yes. Who wouldn't? So it opened this door. Red, move out, please. <sighs> okay, Venus grew to level 56 after fighting a wild Grimer. Now let's give someone else a chance to level up. Crystal, how about you? There you go, boy. Oh my god, look how high his health is. So, what's this item? Okay, as I said, what's this item? Full restore, thank you. So I have to go back over there. I found a level 42 wheezing, can you believe that? So excuse me while I go back over to the east. Okay, I'm back over here. Excuse me. As I was saying, I'm back over here and there's a scientist up here. Okay, come on down. This place is ideal for a lab. Wasn't it a lab before? Maybe not. Then again, Mew was Mew was discovered and used to clone clone them into Mewtwo uh, to make Mewtwo. Okay, you use Magnemites first. I have gas in my throat. Ice Beam Crystal. Take out the scientist as quickly as possible. I still can't believe how high your health is. Wow. Nope, no need to, to switch to, to another Pokemon. Just take take them out with Ice Beam, the Electrode. Well done! Alright, I defeated the scientist. What was that for? That was for obtaining your money and for getting you out of my way. I like it here. It's, con it's conducive to my studies. Then stay here. There are three beds and another switch. What does that do? Does that close a gate somewhere down there? A secret switch? Press it? Yes. Who wouldn't? Alright. Looking at the map. Luckily, there's no door over here, so I get this item. Rare candy, thanks. Is there a hidden... Uh, ugh. I was about to ask if there was a hidden item over here, but no, there's nothing. There is a table over here. As I was saying, there's a table over here. God damn it! What's this item? TM22, what is it? Okay. Solar Beam, no thanks. None of my Pokemon can learn that move. There's no hidden item up here, so... Forget it. There's something over here. Secret key, cool! Okay, what do I use the secret key on? Let's see, I need to go back to Strategy Wiki to see what I need to do. I had to pause the recording for a moment, and I looked up on Strategy Wiki, so it says that the secret key was used to unlock the Cinnabar Island gym, so I'm all set with the key. That was the main goal of use of going to the Cinnabar Island mansion. The Pokemon mansion. So, there's another exit where you have to jump off, as the scientist told you, on floor 3, so that's where I'm going now. Okay, I had to pause the recording while going back, back, backtracking after digging out of the Celadon- I mean, Cinnabar Island Mansion. And look, Crystal grew to level 56 after fighting a wild Ponyta, so I'm going to give Lightning a chance now. I'm on floor 3, right where I want it to be, and I'm going to jump off of this ledge. Let's see where I am. Go swipe on the maps. Aha, uh -huh, so I'm all the way down here. There's nothing else for me to cover, so I'm all set. Dragon, please dig me out of here. I'm gonna show this. <laughs> and for some reason, red went up. 
And we're back in the Pokemon Center. You see, Dig is one of the most important Pokemon moves. If you don't have any escape ropes, just teach your Pokemon Dig if they're capable. So I'm going to heal my Pokemon, and then we're going to the gym. I'll be back. Okay, my Pokemon are healed, so we're going up to the gym. Oh, and if you try to enter the gym before the sin- I mean, the, if, before the Pokemon Lake, then it will say that the door is locked. You can't enter without the secret key. Cinnabar Island Pokemon Gym. Leader, Blaine. The hot-headed Quizmaster. Interesting. Now you can enter. Yo, how's it going, my man? Yo, champion making! The hot-headed Blaine is a fire Pokemon pro. Douse his spirits with water. You better take some burn heals. I don't need any. But thanks for the advice. Oh my god, I have gas in my throat. Here's the first trainer. I was a thief, but I became straight as a trainer. Straight as a trainer? You became straight as a trainer? What? That, that wording doesn't make sense. So when you became a trainer, you became straight. You you can't just change your sexual orientation like that. It, it, it's impossible. No one becomes becomes straight or gay or whatever. They 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 have to be and they they just have to be like that. It's a trait that that you cannot change. A anyway, let's get back to the game. Growlithe is down. Thank you, Lightning. Volpix is next. Let's see. Maybe you can Mega Punch that one. And maybe you can use Seismic Toss on the final Pokemon. Alright, Ninetales. Ooh! Alright, use Seismic Toss. Let's see how much damage Ninetales will take. You know, despite it being a fighting type move in Gen 1, a Gen 1 treats it like a normal type move. Plus, it doesn't do that much damage. That sucks. Just use Seismic Toss again, Lightning. Try again. They're almost there. But at least it might be useful if you're trying to catch some new Pokémon. It it doesn't uh, automatically knock out knock out the wild Pokémon. But thank you, Lightning. I surrender. Yeah, you better surrender with your white clothes instead of your white flag. Oh, I opened the gate. The the door, I mean. I can't help stealing other people's Pokémon. You should join Team Rocket then. Team Rocket accepts anyone who steals people's Pokémon. And who who can handle loot? They're good with loot. Do you know how hot fire? Uh, do you know how hot Pokemon Fire Breath can get? No, tell me. Let me guess. You're another burglar. No, you're a uh, super nerd. Okay. So you start with the Vulpix. Okay, Lightning, just mega punch that fox. Mmm, Mega Punch is a great move. Next is another Vulpix, okay. Mega Punch that one too. Uh, no, stay stay in that one, don't go down to Thunder Wave. And let me guess, your final Pokemon is a Vulpix as well. Ninetales! No, I was wrong. Alright, now finish off this Ninetales with Thunderbolt. Quick attack, damn it. Damn those critical hits. Thunderbolt, please. The oh, so close. Now use Seismic Toss. Finish him off. There you go. Thank you, Lightning. Yo! Hot, hot, hot! None of your Pokemon breathe fire on you. It's not hot. Fire, or to be more precise... Combustion. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, 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 I'm going. Who are you? A burglar or a super nerd? You can't win! I've studied Pokemon totally. Yep, super nerd, I thought so. So you have four Pokemon. Ponyta. So, Lightning? Man, I love Righteous Cry in Gen 1. Use Mega Punch on Ponyta. That's one. Next is a Charmander. Interesting. Just shock that Charmander with your electricity. Thunderbolt. There you go. That's two. Critical hit. Next is a Vulpix. Interesting. 
Mega Punch. Well done. And your final one is a Growlithe. Ooh. Let's see. Try, try Seismic Toast one more time. Let's see how much damage Growlithe would take. Ah. Okay, okay. All right. Ow, lightning, ouch! Seismic Toss again. All right, do I have any burn heals or something? But I, I have a full heal. I could use that. Wah! My studies! Oh, did your studies get burned in your Pokemon's fire? Let's see, I, I need to heal lightning first. Let's see what I have. No, I need to go back to the center. My theories are too complicated for you. Damn right they are. Now I have to go back and heal lightning. I'll be right back, or all my Pokemon, I'll be back. Yo, I'm back at the gym, and let's continue fighting more trainers. I just like using fire Pokemon. Yeah, I thought so. Fire Pokemon are great, even though they're not my favorite type. Who even has a favorite type? Well, I'm sure some of you do, and you're a burglar. So you have a pony to a cute little pony for a cute little short burglar. Just use Thunderbolts and you'll be all set. Aha, I knew you would level up. And see, your defense is at level 9. I mean, your defense is at 91. That's not good. If only you were capable of taking more irons. Too hard to handle. Damn right. You need to you need to get off the ponyta and get some oven mitts or something. And a fire extinguisher. Or maybe not no no no. If use a fire extinguisher on yourself, not on your ponyta. I wish there was a thief Pokemon. I'd use that. Well, starting from generation two, there there's a there's a move called Thief, so you'd like that. Let's see, who do I want to send? Actually, Hurricane, you're up. You need to catch up, catch up with your teammates. There's another one over here. I know why Blaine became a trainer. Why? So he could quiz new trainers and confuse them. So he could kick them out when he gets when when they get the, the riddles wrong. Ah, Rapid Dash, how original. I mean, that that's a new that's a new one. So use Reflect Hurricane. Try not to get burned. Fire spin. Ooh, ouch. Okay, let's try. Hey, Rapida, stop it, please. God, the these moves that continue are so annoying in Gen 1. Okay, that's the third time. Stop it, please. Maybe I can use mirror move. Let's see how you like it. Mirror move and use fire spin. Alright. Let's see how m ah, not much damage. Rapid dash can't move, that's great. Okay, that's two. Now use fly. There you go. And growl failed. That's great. Oh, oh, so close. Maybe you can use fire spin again. I mean, use mirror move again. Rapidash has little health left. Okay, stop it, please, Rapidash. That's two. Stop that, please. It's it's Hurricane's turn to use fire spin. Mirror move. There we go. Let's see how you like it. How do you like them apples? That's one. That's two. You're you're getting burnt right between. You're getting burnt right in your apples between your legs. There you go. Rapidash is down. How do you like that, super nerd? Ow! And I bet your Rapidash kicks you be kicks you in the apples, doesn't he? Blaine was lost in the mountains when a fiery bird Pokemon appeared. Moltres? Its light enabled Blaine to find his way down. That's interesting. So, there's this f another trainer. I, I don't know. I haven't been keeping count on how many trainers there were in this gym. I've been to many gyms, but this is my favorite. Yeah, it has fire types. I can see why. And I bet you like riddles, don't you? No, you're a burglar. Burglars don't like riddles or puzzles. So you send out a Vulpix. Alright, Hurricane. Reflect. Damn, that quick attack, but fortunately quick attack didn't do that much damage. Now use Double Edge. 
Well done. Alright, Vulpix is down, and what's your other Pokemon? Growlithe. We're not, I'm not gonna switch out, just use Double Edge on this Growlithe. Good job. Well done. And the burglar's down. Yowza! Too hot! Damn right, you need to get go get and go get go stand in front of an air conditioner and let let it blow all the, all of your money away and give it to, to some people who need it, like red. Us fire Pokemon fans like Ponyta and Ninetales. Ninetales is great. And there's another one. Fire is weak against two I mean fire is weak against H2O. Thank you for the science. Uh, H, the the two H two stands for two hydrogens and O stands for oxygen. Okay, so you start with a Growlithe. Be careful with a double edge. Take down Mist, because Hurricane was up in the air. All right, Vulpix, don't switch. See mirror move. Ah, mirror move failed because um because Growlithe went down. Oh damn it! Use double edge. Try it. Please don't hurt you. Oh damn it! Come on, Hurricane, please. Ah, good thing Roar on effect. Roar didn't affect um, Vol um, um Hurricane. Okay, finally Hurricane flew up high and he snuffed out a confusion. Oh, that was the quickest fly attack ever. Okay. Oh, snuffed out! Damn right. And the door opened. Water beats fire, but fire melts ice Pokemon and grass. Oh, look at that. That does not look like Blaine. That looks like a generic NPC. Then again, most most NPCs in Gen 1 looks the same. Even, um... Even, you know... What am I doing? Even the gym leaders, that's what I meant. So I'm putting Dragon at the top since it's been a long time since he, he battled a gym leader. Is there a hidden item? No. He hasn't battled a gym leader since Brock, so let's give him this gym. I'm going to give a f I'm going to let a Crystal fight the final gym leader. HA! I am Blaine. I am the leader of Cinnabar Gym. My fiery Pokemon will incinerate all challengers. Ha! You better have Burn Heal! I don't need a Burn Heal because Dragon is a fire type and fire types cannot get burned. Blaine wants to fight. So you start with the Growlithe, interesting. So Dragon, use Swords Dance, get your attack up sharply. Dragon's attack greatly rose. Oh, speed greatly rose, that's not good. So use Dig. Super Potion! Are you serious? You use a Super Potion on a Pokemon with full health? Are you serious, Blaine? Wow, and you're supposed to be a smart guy. God damn it, what are you thinking? Okay, Ponyta. Use Dig on that one too. You, why are you using Super Potions on Pokemon with full health? Seriously, are you stupid? Man, what is wrong with you? Okay, Rapidash is going down with Dig, too. Are you going to use another Super Potion? Nope. Good thing you didn't use a Super Potion now. That was stupid of you. You wasted two potions on po two Pokemon with full health. God damn it, and you're supposed to be intelligent. Okay, your final Pokemon is an Arcanine. Your Pokemon are really taking damage, aren't they? Four digs in a row. Now you see Dragon, now you don't. Let's see how much damage Arcanine will take. Ooh, look at that! Dragon, you're amazing! See how much easier gym battles get when you evolve and are at higher levels? The more you train, the easier battles get. And I've defeated Blaine just like that. Isn't that amazing? I have burnt out! You have earned the Volcano Badge. Thank you. Ha! <laughs> The Volcano Badge heightens the special abilities of your Pokémon. Here, you can have this too. TM38, what is it? 
Team 38 contains Fire Blast. Ah, uh, Fire Blast, but I'd rather have Fi- a Flamethrower because that has a higher accuracy rate. Thank you. Teach it to Fire-type Pokémon. Charmeleon or Ponyta would be good bets. What about Charizard? But then again, he knows Flamethrower, that's enough. Fire Blast is the ultimate fire technique. Don't waste it on water Pokémon. Of course, because water Pokémon can't- Oh, no, no, that's because it's not super effective against water types, I get it. So we're all set with this gym and Cinnabar Island. Well, almost done with Cinnabar Island. We need to get that fossil back. We need to see how that broken English scientist is doing. Red, you beat that firebrand. Cinnabar Island Pokemon Gym. Later, Blaine. Winning trainers, um, Blue, of course, and Red. Okay, now I need to go to the Pokemon Center, heal my team, store one in the PC, get the fossil back, and we're all set. Yo, we're inside the Pokemon Laboratory, so we're going all the way down to this... Uh, down, all the way down at this hallway, and here's the scientist. Don't walk away from me. Where were you? Your fossil is back to life. It was Kabuto-like, I think. I got the Kabuto, nice. And no, I'm not gonna give him a nickname. Hiya! I am important doctor. I study here rare Pokemon fossils. You, have your fossil for me? No, it's too bad. Yeah, I... Thanks for reviving my... Uh, my, uh, dome fossil into... Into a Kabuto. Let's see. Level 30, ooh, interesting. It won't take long for... Actually, it might take long for to, to evolve him into a Kubutops. Another one to my Pokedex, so I'm going to store him into my PC and get my other Pokémon back, which is lucky. Okay, I'm all set with Cinnabar Island, but before I go to the Viridian Gym, I'm going to train my Pokémon up at the Pokémon Mansion some more. I'm going to stop right here, so thank you, my healers, for joining me on this adventure. Feel free to give this video a like, and I'll see you in the next one. And don't get on my bitter side.